that rattles. Ring, 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 ring. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This week I am doing a What's in My Baby's Hospital Bag, which would be this little thing. Um, this little thing is actually quite huge. I got it on Amazon. It is by Soho Designs. Not sponsored at all, but if you're looking for a huge a diaper bag that's bigger and like gender neutral um, <clears throat> and with had lots of storage space or whatnot, this bag here is the way to go. Um, yes. So there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, six, six pockets outside, and there's about like one, two. Four, and then um, it comes with a, com a, a like a like a storage compartment where you can put it inside and it becomes the like 10 pockets in a row so there's like a good 14 pockets that can fit inside here and plus it comes with like uh, bottle warm like bottle warmer holders or whatever so I really like this bag. I like it a lot, mostly because it's huge and there are stripes on it. I don't know if you can tell, but yes. Let's give this thing a go. All right, so I like to over-prepare than under-prepare. I know the hospital is supposed to provide us with a lot, but personally, I would like to be prepared uh, just in case we don't get enough or something happens on the way home. Or, you know, like, since this is also going to be my diaper bag, that we just have stuff in there anyway, in case something happens, whatever. Okay, so, first, we have love this diaper. I packed about four of them. I know the hospital will give us some. They are literally the size of my hand, and my hand is super small. So these are super small and super cute diapers. I know um, the hospital, like I said, the hospital will give us some but I just wanted to pack a couple just in case like she has an accident on the way home or the, or you know, just so the diaper bag has stuff in it. Um, I know she probably might not wear these in the hospital, but I pack little bows just in case. Can you see them? Can you see them? Can you see it? I don't know. I can see it. That's all that matters. They're cute. They got like little flowers and, but yeah, I like these. I like bows. I personally will put as many bows on her as I can if she likes it. I know I didn't like it. I also packed a couple of beanies. I'm just showing you this one because my friend Courtney made it and I'm obsessed with it and I just think it'd be really cute. I don't know if she'll wear it but I definitely will try to make her wear it. I think the hospital will give us one too but you know you know so the hot so our diaper bags packed for like other times. Also excuse that last little like bodily function sound you heard. Also, my husband, we were looking <clears throat> for coming home outfits or whatever, and I saw one that I loved, and he saw all the, uh, what should I call it, 4th of July stuff. So he fell in love with this one. It says, All American Cutie, and I love this one because of the colors, and it says, just little cutie because she'll be a little cutie. She has two outfits of choice in case anything happens to one. And then I packed one that's a little bigger in size. This is zero to three months. So it has a little more tummy room, I think. But she has one in a size bigger just in case. And of course, there's more like just simple hospital white ones in there. But um, <clears throat> that's, those are in case something happens like in the car, on the way home or anything, or there's just extra clothes in there for her when we go out and she's already here on the other side of my diaper bag I have this cute little snuggle toy uh, it like rattles um, it's so cute it says I love mommy she better love mommy because I carried her for nine months um, but yes it's a cute little monkey and I don't know if newborns like toys or even play with toys, but if she is one of the kinds that likes the rattling noise or likes to play with something or snuggle with something, she has something soft and cute to have next to her in the, her car seat on the way home. Um, <clears throat> I have two burp cloths. This is one of them. Um, just to burp her within the hospital. I have some, some blanket birthing cloths. That look like this um, in case anything happens to like 
the small ones that aren't that like they're like they're not enough for something like she like has a bigger mess then we have those to rely on and then I packed two swaddles I packed this one and a plain white one um, they're muslin, the muslin swaddles. I don't know if you've like heard of them ever. Oh yeah, people hear them all the time because they're like the new cool thing, right? But yeah, so I packed two of them again. One for sure so she can have on her like wear and then so we can swaddle her in and then the other one just in case there's an accident. Also in these pockets on this side, I have a pacifier clip that says I love daddy and a pacifier. Um, for her. I'm hoping she takes to a pacifier. I know I did. I stayed with it for a very long time and then I had buck teeth because of it. But now I have a perfectly great smile. Um, so yeah, I mean, if you're against pacifying, pacifiers, that's okay, but I'm not and neither is my husband. So if she takes to it, that's all I care about. It's a happy baby. Um, how do I? Okay. Okay, we fixed it. And then, last but not least, we have little socky walkies for her tiny little feetsy weetsies. And then dog hair because my dog likes to be everywhere on things, even though I washed all of this stuff already. Um, my camera is flashing, that has a little battery. And I pack little mittens in case she's a scratcher. Pink little mittens. All right, I really thought this would take a lot longer to film, but it didn't. This is my diaper bag, so hospital bag, and what I have in it, but let me know what you have in yours. Let me know what you have in yours, and leave me suggestions down below in case I missed anything to put in her bag. Oh my god, I also packed wipes, but they're somewhere in here and my camera's going to die. Thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me this week. Don't forget to subscribe because Colton said he will do his makeup or let me do his makeup if we get to 100 subscribers. And I personally would love to see that because he is so against it. He doesn't, he won't even let me do it in like real life without the camera there. So I'm pretty excited that he's going to let me do this on camera for uh, me to document and put out publicly. He's very shy. Um, yeah, I look forward to hanging out with you next week. Let's get to 100 and let's pray this baby comes out. Okay, bye guys.